We have new coronavirus numbers to report. First, Kansas is reporting more than 1,000 new cases since Friday. Missouri fielded more than 1,000 new cases since Sunday. We also like to look at this chart. It shows the seven-day rolling average of what's called the uh, positivity rate, one of the best ways to see how the virus is spreading. In Kansas, you see the blue line going down there. 11.5% of tests are coming back positive now. was much higher last week. Health officials say that's due in part to a change in the way tests are being reported. The rate has fallen in Missouri. That's the yellow line there to 13.1%. The national average on the bottom is 8%. Doctors at the University of Kansas Health System say four of their patients died over the weekend from COVID-19. Right now, there are 30 people being treated for coronavirus in the system. 16 of those patients are in the ICU. Five are on ventilators. Doctors say these patients aren't just elderly people. A range uh, over the weekend, the youngest patient in the hospital um, was 19 and the oldest uh, patient in the hospital of, with COVID uh, positive here um, was uh, I think uh, 87 or 86. So quite the range. Uh, we still have plenty of 20 and 30 year olds that are in the hospital. Uh, I think really mirroring what we're seeing as far as spread of the disease in the community, that, that um, all ages are being affected um, and that um, a portion of those that are infected, regardless of age, end up in the hospital. Kansas Health Secretary Dr. Lee Norman is part of today's briefing. You can watch it right now at KMBC.com or on our KMBC9 Facebook page. Kansas City, Missouri Health Department is hosting drive through coronavirus testing events this week. Today, health care workers will be over at East High School in Independence Boulevard Christian Church. We've also listed locations for the rest of the week here. They'll be there from 9 to 2. The health Department does recommend that you make an appointment online, though. That's just because the supplies run out so quickly, and there are only about 50 walk-up spots available every day. The Wyandotte County Health Department, meanwhile, hosting its own testing events weekly throughout the month of August. Testing usually runs from 8 to 11 in the morning with an evening option available for you on Thursday.